Bulilani Moyake's story is perhaps no different to that of many other young South Africans. The 17-year-old, who now lives in Jozo Gramstown with his grandmother and younger brother, was brought up in a home of alcohol and abuse. He used to live in Neisner with his parents. His mother is an alcoholic who is also unemployed, and Bulilani says his father's only way of dealing with the problem is through physically abusing his mother. I was tired of always telling her to stop drinking, because when she's drunk, she'd come home and just beat us, the mother, just beat us, and the father was just get angry and beat her. Bulilani was glad to move as he thinks his parents were a bad influence. Although the experience was painful for him, he misses them a lot. He also faces the common problem of not having enough finances to go to university. I'm scared. I'm working here. In the, the reason I'm working here, uh, my parents okay. couldn't pay for the university fees and I applied late for the financial aid scheme. So I thought I could come here instead of sitting at home doing bad things like crime, involving myself in crime. Instead of letting his problems stand in his way, Bulilani fights them by giving back to his community through the Love Life program at Lukulu Clinic in Joza. He says one of the challenges that they face is knowing young people in similar situations but that do not speak out. They, are one okay. one. they don't want to talk about their problems. Mm. That, that doesn't help because if you, the more you talk, the more you get help. Now, Lape Clinic is... We told them to come here if they have a problem, but they don't come. Mm. His greatest aspiration is to become a botanist. He is currently reapplying for university and financial aid. Bulilani is a clear example to many that no matter how dire your situation is, the decision to turn it around lies in your hands.